let me take the door with you. Baby Tank, this is Uncle Man. Come over with me. Ah! Tank, you stop moving. Ah! Get your there with you. You're like your dad said you ah! want to put here. Now dad, far. Dad, he said dad. We found a father for the baby tank. Watch out. Ah! Everyone, you've got to help the tank defeat the Tyrannosaurus Rex. Yeah. You guys can go and put the tank in the family behind the trees. <laughs> okay, get over here. We're gonna help you. I can fight it. I can fight it. Now go behind the trees, everybody. Now from your seats, when I sing out, make a sound like this. We're gonna create the biggest dust storm this world's ever seen. Now ready? Thanks, Ron, for the respect. We're a terrible we did it! We defeated the rest! Rex is gone. You defeated her. But the swamp is gone. Everything is gone. All oh, there's miles and miles of sand. Come on, Brassard. It's time to move on. What do you mean, time to move on? The is hungry and thirsty. So that is stay in the land from the swamp. Don't you understand? No, I don't understand. We gotta find a swamp. A lake. Something for us. Come on, Brassard. What's wrong? Don't you want to live? Come on! Tank, hey, don't you understand? It's the sand. She can't move in the sand. She's too heavy. Of course she can't move. Kid butter in your ring, ready to move. Everyone, we're going to help the tank and his family to a safer place. Now grab the arm of the mammal next to you. When I say pull, we're going to pull him over all this crappy stuff. Ready? Pull! Pull! It's hard! It's so harder! Pull! It's working! Wait for me! Pull! Everybody, shake! We're going over to Earthquake. Shake! Shake! Get us out of here. Come on, pull! And we're stopping, stopping, stop. Thank you, everybody. This isn't gonna work. We gotta go down the mountain. Ready? Grab the arm of the mammal. Ready? Go! Pull! Pull! We're going down, down, down the mountain. And we're stopping, stopping, stop. Thank you, everybody. Okay, look, pine trees. Pine forest. Can you eat that? No, I can't eat that. You gotta find some swamp. Oh well, wait, something. Well, we gotta pull again. Ready? Pull. <laughs> wait a minute. I smell something. Something? Warm? Hot? Steamy? I smell a swamp. It's a swamp. Tank, look. Trees, swamps, forests, grass. Can you eat that? Yeah. Well, we find a place where they'll never go hungry and they can live for a long time. It's time for us to go. What? Tank, it's not our time, not our place. We have to go. Well, if you're going to leave, then leave. Bye-bye, Brontosaurus. Watch out for mud holes. If it's goodbye, then it's goodbye. But remember, when this dinosaur is gone, it's going to be your guys' world, your time, your mammal's world. So take care of yourself, and always remember the tank. Attention, the tank salute. You finally got it right. <laughs> Everybody, one more time, stand up. For the tank, the tank salute. Bye bye, baby tank. No more fur on my arms, or yours, or yours. We're getting back to our world. There's no more dinosaurs, because they became small reptiles, and we, we became big hairy mammoths, and small hairy horses, then apes, then human beings. This is our world, the world of human beings, and there's no more dinosaurs. It is our name. Because we're hot like a dancing flame. We are the game that can't be beat. We'll burn you back with our flames in peace. <laughs>
No one gives us aggravation because they risk consideration. We are the top that's what we said. We are the best because we are red. We are the blues and we're no fools. What we are, of course, is cool. No trouble comes to take our advice. Who troubles heat with the cool of ice? Don't fall prey to desperation. Stay cool with refrigeration. Time for time. It's true, man. Too hot for the blues. Stand back now. You're tempted to faint. You blues will incinerate. Stay cool and tip your mind to muddle. Because by afternoon's ice is too a puddle. Get off our turf and don't be rude. For you just might be part of you. If you don't want my adhesive to slow, then back up now and hit the road. You sure said that one, do we care? Because I thought there's a bunch of hot air. If fire melts ice is your claim to fame, the cool drink that's left is down your flame. Is it sure your turn? Don't be so sure, because we control the temperature. And if you can't take the lower degrees, then drink it. We're going to decrease. got visitors if I believe my eyes. How do you get here? Where do you come from, dude? Well, enough of this. I'm being rude. First things first is the way to go, so I'd like to welcome you all to our little show. You're in a magical place called the Lost Land where things haven't happened well, getting out of hand. But not to worry, no need to fear. Dig the dragon, that's me is here. I'll be your friend if you'll be mine. We'll chill together and have a fine time. I'll say yo dudes when we are meeting. And you'll say, yo, Deke, to return to greeting. You got it? You hip? Let's try it out. Take a deep breath and get ready to shout. Yo, dudes. Yo, dudes. That's pretty good for the first time around. But you can do better. Give me twice the sound. Yo, dudes. Yo, dudes. Now that's the volume I'd like to hear. Just make sure it's that loud when I am here. I gotta go, but I'll be back around. Just listen for my call. What's this I found? There's somebody here, and there's somebody there. Golly T. Wilkins, there's somebody everywhere. These must be some real tired dudes, but sleeping in the dirt is kind of crude. I'd be interested to know what this is about. Well, guess there's only one way for me to find out. What happened? Where are we? Yo, dudes. What strange questions? Funny you should ask, but answering them will be my present task. Where are you? Where do you stand? You're in a magical place called the Lost Land. This place is lost, or so it seems, because it only lives inside your dreams. You came here a lot when you were a kid, though you may not remember that you did. The thing that you used as your transportation back then was known as your imagination. Don't you recall? Hey, it's a snap. Get down and do the Lost Land rap. Now how you got here sure has got me beat. You sure didn't come here on your feet. There must be some good explanation for your sudden materialization. But don't you worry, don't you grieve. We'll have good times before you leave. It's bad when we let aggravation spoil potentially great unplanned vacations. Watch you don't fall into that trap. Get down and do the lost land rap. Now what am I? It don't take no wizard to see that I'm one funky lizard. I'm not the kind that you call a bore. I'm a seriously happening dinosaur. You'll notice, friends, just from my style, I'm a particular kind of, well, 
hip reptile. So before your question is turned to Nike, let me say you are truly as a dragon. Still confused? Well then perhaps you should get down and do the Lost Land Rap. The Lost Land you found it. There's no way around it. You got
thank you, thank you. Now remember, treat me with a lack of respect I deserve. Oh, where's the blue champion? Oh, yes, 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 the red and the blues. You wouldn't by any chance have seen two delightfully nasty groups of young people that call themselves the reds and the blues. They left. Which way, pray tell, did they go? Both All right, make up your mind, people. There's some of these tracks that one group went this way, and one group went that way, and uh-oh. Uh-oh. What do you mean, uh-oh? Dragon tracks. Curse the denunciation. Can't I ever do any evil body without that dragon sticking his snout into it? I mean, he's always so happy and merry and cheerful and happy. And those rhymes. He must think he's the greatest thing to happen in the world since William Shakespeare. Well, I could rhyme if I wanted to. Couldn't I, Max? Uh, without a doubt, work of iniquity. As a matter of fact, I think I'll do it right now. Right now, Mr. Uh, maybe you should rest up a bit. Perhaps after your nap? Nonsense! That stupid dragon can do it. Anybody can. Brace yourself for a poetic masterpiece. I'm the Duke of Nastiness. I'm known as the Dark Knight. When children hear my name aloud, they cry and cower in fear. My evil reputation is known in countries near and far. And I'm guaranteed to cause you grief no matter where you are. Oh, bye. I like to twist and destroy things. I love to watch them break. A natural disaster is best described as a great dark night earth trimmer. <laughs> Why? Quake. Maybe avalanches. Quake, Mr. Stillen. Quake, 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 yes, yes, quake. My schemes of domination are on a global scale. I'm virtually assured success. My plan just cannot falter. There's one day that I look for, the day for which I plan. The day that I become emperor of this entire location. I'll rank up all my enemies and watch them scream and yell. I will laugh into their faces as I send them straight to hell. Hades. <laughs> oh, my intellectual genius can create almost any rhyme. And just to prove that's how it is, I'll try it one more minute. I'm so bad. I'm starting to get a little bit myth. All right, so I can't do this trick. I don't like the rhyme anyway. This stuff makes me suffer. Oh, I'm glad that up here, so It's a veritable feast of versification. All right, so I can't rhyme. I hate rhyming almost as much as I hate that lizard, Deke. So you've seen Deke, have you? And I bet you like him, don't you? Well, then you can feel free to hate me, because I'm the Dark Knight! <laughs> Rather nice. We've been on the road with our heavy load for months. 